or they don't approve of how you're raising. So this is part two. Somebody don't approve Sagittarius of how you're raising your daughter or something like that. So spoil you brat, close connection to father. Used to being taken care of financially expects you to play dad. Okay. Sagittarius, um, yeah. This Queen of Cups either feel as though you're a daddy's girl or your daughter or your daughters are a daddy's girl. So, <clears throat> Sagittarius, I don't know. This could be a baby shower. Um, this could be you getting proposed to. This could be a wedding. You might be marrying your daughter's father and the Queen of Cups don't approve of it. Uh, something like that going on, Sagittarius. Or it could be your daughter's birthday party. Some It could be a function going on for your daughter. Okay. What's Sagittarius' issue with the Queen of Cups? What is Sagittarius' issue with the Queen of Cups? Family interference. Yeah, that Queen of Cups is definitely your family. Yeah, whether um, by blood or marriage. The Queen of Cups is um, definitely your family. So Sagittarius, your issue with the Queen of Cups is family interference. The Queen of Cups could be interfering, giving their opinion... As well, the Queen of Cups could also be a man too, so keep that in mind. It could be a man in his masculine and his feminine energy. So Sagittarius, I don't know. This Queen of Cups could be your lover. And he's probably upset because you're mingling with your daughter's father. Or something. Or he feels as though something is unnecessary and y'all might have a disagreement because of your daughter. Yeah, the Queen of Cups could be a man. He's just in his feminine energy. And um, this man could be your lover or even your father. But anyway, your issue with the Queen of Cups is relatives are budding in family, manip family manipulation and nosy loved ones. Yeah, so this could be something as simple as Sagittarius. You could be giving your daughter a birthday party. And your family, the Queen of Cups is like, now this is this don't make no sense. <laughs> this party don't don't <laughs> this party costs too much. Like Sagittarius don't have to do all this for um they daughter. Like this is this this don't this don't make no sense. Like something like that could be going on, Sagittarius. <laughs> that Queen of Cups, like you, mm -mm. maybe the Queen of Cups feel as though you spent too much money on your daughter's birthday party. Or Sagittarius, the Queen of Cups could be your baby father's mother. And she some yeah, she don't like something. Um, Sagittarius, you could have had your child's father spend money for your daughter's birthday party, and his mother don't appreciate that. She feels as though y'all spent too much money on that on the baby's birthday party. Or something like that. Yeah. Something going on. Yeah. So Let me put some tea on them. Well, Sagittarius, you could have had your father. You could have had your father confront either your husband or your child's father. And the Queen of Cups could still be your um your lover's mother. And she might confront you about something like at this function. Something you did to her son. Or she claimed you did to her son. Something like that. Or she could just be upset, Sagittarius, that you're marrying her son. The Queen of Cups can be your husband's or your soon-to-be husband's mother. And she could she could just be mad that y'all getting married. But the Queen of Cups think you're a daddy's girl. So Sagittarius, your child's father or your soon-to-be husband, they could be very wealthy. And maybe the Queen of Cups is assuming that you're using her son for money. <clears throat> you want to be taken care of, or you want her son to take care of you as if he's your father, as if he's your father. But anyway, give me the T. What's the T with number one and the Queen of Cups? What's the T with number one? Yeah, happiness hater. Yeah. Sagittarius, it's your time. It's your time. It's your function. And the, I think that Queen of Cups is hating. Yeah, that Queen of Cups is either your mother, Sagittarius, or your husband's mother. <clears throat> I 
Or that Queen of Cups could be a man. And he's in his feminine energy. But I think it's a woman. Yeah, somebody upset. But this person is being a hater. That's the T. So this issue that this person has with you is actually an excuse. But the T is this person is really a happiness hater. Yeah, that's the T. But this person, the Queen of Cups is saying, uh-uh. I'm not hating on Sagittarius. My issue with Sagittarius is that Sagittarius is a daddy's girl or Sagittarius spoil you her daughter. Or spoil you her daughters. But the cards is telling me, uh-uh. The T is the Queen of Cups is a happiness hater. <laughs> That's funny. Because Sagittarius, you have happiness and popularity. Yeah. <laughs> and it could be like a wedding or a honeymoon or... Some type of bridal shower or something like that. Or this can also be Sagittarius. This could be something as simple as you not even married yet. But it's like you're posting like your proposal. Like on Facebook or Instagram and the Queen of Cups see it. So the, the wedding or the marriage is not even official. This could be something you're proposing on um, social media. You're posting on social media. All right. What's the T with the number 34? The star and the nine of swords. Yeah, ain't shit. Ain't shit. <laughs> ain't shit. So, Sagittarius, I don't know. The Queen of Cups probably feel as though you ain't shit. Or Sagittarius, the Queen of Cups is making you feel like you ain't shit. That's the T. Something that Queen of Cups say to you or do to you, Sagittarius, you gonna feel like you ain't shit. Mm-hmm. That's the team. It's like Sagittarius. You have a guilty, a guilty conscience for nothing. Well, Sagittarius, you could be keeping secrets and you got a guilty conscience for a reason. Mm-hmm. It's like Sagittarius. This Queen of Cups probably knows something about you. <laughs> and she not telling your secrets, but she poking at you. <laughs> that's kind of like what that's looking like, too. <laughs> The Queen of Cups poking at you, Sagittarius. Because that Queen of Cups do care about you. She got love for you. But Sagittarius, she going to poke at you and jam at you at the wrong time. She hiding her love for you, Sagittarius. Because you done did something to that Queen of Cups. Done something. But, yeah. Yeah, Sagittarius, I think the Queen of Cups just going to spoil you your, your, your happiness. She might spoil you it. And she got you feeling like you ain't shit. Yeah, she gonna spoil it. So just be mindful of that. <clears throat> yeah, this is emotional manipulation. The Queen of Cups is gonna do something or say something to you, Sagittarius. Because it's like you have success here. But you're gonna feel so like unlucky, like something is bittersweet. So the Queen of Cups is manipulating you emotionally. But what's wrong with number one, the sun, and the queen of cups with happiness hater? What's wrong with this? Yeah, promiscuous. Sleeps around a hoe. Free for all. Sleeps with your man. What? Okay. 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 So Sagittarius. The queen of cups. Oh my God. The Queen of Cups could be promiscuous. That's what's brewing. It's telling me that the Queen of Cups is a happiness hater. So Sagittarius, the Queen of Cups probably like your boyfriend or your husband or something. Because the car says she'll sleep with your man. Or she done slept with him, Sagittarius. But she making you feel some type of way. Sagittarius, your soon-to-be ex-husband, your child's father, your boyfriend could have been sleeping with that Queen of Cups. And he got the nerve to propose to you. And you like going to post it like on social media or something. And it's like Sagittarius, you don't know though. But that Queen of Cups knows she's sleeping with your man. And now she know y'all making it official. That Queen of Cups going to say something to you. She's going to say something to you. Or she's going to say something about your kids. But the whole time Sagittarius, that Queen of Cups might try to sleep with your man again. Or your child's father. Yeah, she going to try to sleep with him. Either she, either she never slept with him, but since she found out y'all getting married, she's going to try to sleep with him to break up your happiness 
Or if Sagittarius, that Queen of Cups was sleeping with like your husband, your soon-to-be husband, or your baby father. She slept with him before, or she's going to attempt to, because she's a happiness hater. Yeah, that's what's brewing. The Queen of Cups gonna, is going to become promiscuous. Because she want to break up your happiness. She want to tear up your happiness. Sagittarius, the Queen of Cups might also, um, if this is like in love, the Queen of Cups might try to go to your, your, your soon-to-be husband, your child's father, and gossip about you. She want to talk about you to your lover. Yeah. So, what's wrong with the Nine of Swords, number 34, and ain't shit? <clears throat> what's wrong with that? Yeah. Because it's like Sagittarius. Whoever the Queen of Cups is, she's family to you. She family to you. She love you. She care about you. But when she realized, Sagittarius, that you're happy or you get some type of popularity, she going to put her, um, her respect for you on the back burner. And she's going to become promiscuous. Yeah. She got love for you, but she going to put that on the back burner because she jealous. Yeah. Or Sagittarius, this can also be, I just heard, um, this, um, Queen of Cups, she want to cry. She want to cry because she could be jealous. Or Sagittarius, the Queen of Cups probably got a crush on your boyfriend or she was sleeping with him. And when she find out whatever this is, she going to be upset. The Queen of Cups going to be upset. And she's going to emotionally manipulate you. She's going to say something or she's going to do something. And it's emotional manipulation. Yeah. Um, what's wrong with the star, the nine of swords, and ain't shit? Sagittarius, I'm also kind of picking up too. You could have slept with the queen of cups lover like in the past. You did something to the queen of cups. And when the Queen of Cups find out you're either pregnant or you're about to get married or something like that, that Queen of Cups gonna try to get revenge because you did it to her in the past. Yeah. So what's brewing with the Nine of Swords number 34 and ain't shit? What's brewing? Yeah. Bugaboo. That's what's brewing. A bugaboo. Yeah. Yeah. Um... Sagittarius, I think the Queen of Swords is going to start bugging you. Yeah, buggable. The Queen of Swords. She going to start bugging you, but she want to be in your business because she want to sleep with your man, Sagittarius. So be careful. So either you're aware that the Queen of Cups is promiscu promiscuous, Sagittarius, or, you're, or you just think that the Queen of Cups want to be around you because of your happiness and popularity. But Sagittarius, be careful because that Queen of Cups is really trying to get sleep with your man. Yeah. So whoever that Queen of Cups is, um, Sagittarius, it's like she becomes a bugaboo. So for example, Sagittarius, say like you win the lottery. And you and everybody in your family know the Queen of Cups only come around when she like on payday. Whoever the Queen of Cups is, she only come around when she know pe certain people got money. So it's like I'm giving it for example, Sagittarius, say like everybody in the family know you done hit the lottery. And you like, oh damn! I know the Queen of Cups gonna start coming to my house every day because now everybody know I got I won the lottery. But Sagittarius, the Queen of Cups is gonna start coming around you because you did hit the lottery. But she also has a hidden agenda. She wants to sleep with your man. Yeah, she's promiscuous. Sleeps around a hoe, free for all. Sleeps with your man. Mm hmm. That's what's brewing. The Queen of Cups is getting ready to do something very promiscuous. Yep. And what's brewing for you, Sagittarius? That Queen of Cups going to start um coming around you. And you know it. Yeah. Yeah, because she, she wants something from you. But she also wants something else, Sagittarius. And I think she wants to sleep with your man. Yeah. Yep. So, that's what I have for you, Sagittarius. This is Blood Queen Tarot. Please don't forget <clears throat> to like, comment, subscribe, and or share. And Sagittarius, enjoy the month of January and thank you.